Hi, I just wanted to go over um, the items really quick. So for the remaining task number one, um, setting up everything according to the PowerPoint. And that's just if we could fix the graphics and make them look normal. I just want them to look like the, the PowerPoint as much as possible. So like for this first screen, I'm even fine with just doing a screenshot and, and then uploading that graphic so it fills the whole slide. Um, stuff like this, like this piece right here, right now, if you go look, um, I hope I can figure out where I'm at. Okay, here we go. If we go into here and that first slide, um, actually it was a second slide, but let me go back. Hang on. Second slide. It's in there. It's just ginormous down below. I made it smaller. It was really huge. But if we could just get it up in here, um, and it just requires some kind of maybe formatting on your end to make it easier to put this into a, a wrap around so that the text will wrap around the image. Because we can keep everything, you know, in a rectangular shape and make it look nice. Um, they want it to look as professional as possible. This one obviously would be too hard to do, so you could just leave the border out. But this one right here, um, you can leave out this part, but maybe even just get this as a graphic in there. Um, just as many of them as you can, so it looks as close to the PowerPoint presentation as possible. <clears throat> Sorry, when I get really tired, my voice starts to go, and it's definitely going. Um, okay, the second thing on there, let me go back to here, actually to here, and B was getting rid of... We had this quiz functionality, and I don't know what app it is. I have no idea, but somewhere in, um, seriously? Yeah, I'll just need to go away. Oh, I'm in the actual coach's corner, that's why. Okay, if I go over here and get back to the WP admin. Anyway, somewhere in here there's an app that manages those quizzes. And every time we upgraded WordPress, it would break that app. So to fix it, we don't want to spend time fixing it. All we want to do is get rid of the quizzes. So that was the second part. I, I just saw that it had not been done, but it's under... Um, oh, I have to go back here. If we go in here, on both trainings, they both have them, and they're called learning checks. So you go into each module, at the end of the slides, you'll see a learning check right here. These all have to be deleted. I can't delete, obviously, because the delete button's not working. But anything that's labeled learning check, just delete the whole section, both in the new training and in the... I don't know if we had it. No, because you you didn't add those in the in the returning coach training. I don't think so. Anyway, if they are there, we need to get rid of any learning checks. So that was 1B. And then 1C, for the resources, I already um, upload the document of what it should look like and then just links to those other documents rather than having them all in, inside. And of course, we have to fix the formatting here because this should be up higher. The tabs look different. Actually, they just look like they're, like they're cut off. Yeah, maybe there's just some formatting or spacing issues there. I don't know. But if we can get it to look normal, that would be great. And I think that's it for 1A, B, and C. And then for the training process, I'll do a separate um, screencast.